why I woke up at about noon. My mom wasn't home, but she came home, and I was already downstairs after I already took a shower and everything. And she was like, Rebecca, you have to mow the lawn today. It really, really needs to get mowed. And two things about that. Number one, why is it every single time I have one of these videos, I have to mow the lawn? Number two. I already took a shower and everything, and mowing the lawn takes like three hours. So, I'm going to do more of a what I'm going to end up doing today. Because, I yeah, after I mow the lawn, I'm just like, going to be gross and stuff, and I don't want to bother taking another shower until I go to bed. It's like a waste of my life. So, here's my dog, Minky. Hi, so Minky. Mikey. You're being sleepy, Maggie. Maggie. <laughs> Maggie. That's my little girl, Maggie. Oh, I've had to, um, today, what I have done is I've rebandaged Maggie's foot, like, three times. You know, like, the little pad that's, like, up here, farther on their foot? Yeah. Maggie almost ripped hers off. Isn't that right, Maggie? And then it healed a little bit, and so we had to take your bandages off. But then you were silly and ate it. Well, you didn't eat it, but she was picking at it. Sorry, Mindy. My hand, you look at me. Oh, that's Mindy. I don't think she likes the camera. So, back here in the creepy room in my basement, I have all of my things. Do you see that? That garbage bag's full of fabric, that's full of fabric. That roll has like 30 bajillion different things of fabric on it that I've ironed. There's the iron. Here's the ironing board. Here's the mini ironing board. Here's my laptop. I spent forever and a day doing all of that fabric stuff, like getting it all done. I'm pretty sure everything I've already ironed, I'm going to have to iron again because I had to roll it up really, really quickly because my mom swore that she told me, but she didn't, that um, we had family friends coming over to remove everything in my basement. If you look at my basement, there's my uncle. We didn't remove him, unfortunately. That's the basement. Yeah, there's nothing in it. But yeah, she didn't tell me that, so I had all my stuff all over the basement because I was ironing it so I could put all my fabric away. That's one of the things I'm going to eventually get done. Today, four shizzles. One of the other things that I'm going to be doing today is binder covers for Paranormal Society. Because, you know, me and Amanda are now president, uh, Trips were co-presidents of Paranormal Society, and so we want binders for everyone who's on the board, and so I'm making pretty binder covers, if you want to see. Paranormal Society President, and there's the oh, it's a ghost. It's a ghost. Yeah, so I've been making those. I actually only have that one and another one done. I'm putting a lot, a lot of an obnoxious amount of time into it. Um, I'm kind of thinking I should put like St. Cloud State somewhere on it, but I don't know. Maybe I'll make it so I can put that on the sides of um, I mean, be yeah, yeah, we'll do that. Um, another thing I'm going to be doing today is. Well, at least my mom wants me to do it today, but I don't think I'm going to get around to it because I already have a bunch of other stuff I'm supposed to be doing. Is packing up my room. Look at my room and all of the shit. No, no, no. It actually used to look a lot worse because all the fabric that I showed you guys down in the basement all used to be up here. And my mom got me this box. Isn't that a pretty box? And you open it and it's like, ooh, it's a pretty box. It's like fake marble or something. And oh my gosh, look, it's all my little gnomes. They're all like packed up in like bubble wrap and stuff. And some of them aren't painted like those ones. They don't have the color. <sighs> yeah, those are my gnomes that I've painted. I'm actually bringing them to school because I found them in my old storage boxes. So I have my gnomes. My army, they have names like, you know, Skull Crusher. And I don't remember any of the other And as for the challenge, 
to go to like my special place outside or something. Um, I don't really have a special place outside of my house. I normally just go to my room. Um, but I don't know, I guess so that we can go find the church across the street because I've gone there a couple of times. Like, literally. Um, yeah. Yeah, because I, I go there when I want to be in the house and I just want to cry. Oh, and I didn't show you guys my Jesus sandals. These are my Jesus sandals. Pretty sure Jesus has worn them. Yeah, and so I come right here under this cross and sit. Here's what it looks like. I've actually never seen this in the daytime. I only come at night. So. So I'm pretty sure hobos live here in this bus. The doors are always open. But this window was broken. Well, on my way back, I have found a secret path. But I'm also running out of film, so I have to keep everything short. I have 39 seconds of filming left. Look at the secret tunnel. I'm probably gonna die down here. And there'll be no evidence. Oh, there's a bird. Birdie. Secret tunnel. Secret tunnel. Through the mountains. Secret, 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 secret tunnel. Yeah. Oh gosh. I wonder where I'm supposed to go. Oh yeah, and yes, you guys probably saw all the cornfields before. They're typical of Corcoran cornfields. Yeah, haha. <laughs> funny, funny. Oh, it's beeping at me now. I'm about to die. Oh no. Don't hurt it or feed him. No. I can't believe I forgot this part, but I did. You know, the part where you pick the person for the next video. Um, I decided that it is going to be Tamara, because we haven't seen Tamara in a while. And her challenge is to have ten different scenes. Two hands. Ten different um, scenes in your video in which you are wearing something very noticeable. You know, like maybe uh, a weird ass hat, or a fancy pants mask, or an obnoxious looking shawl, or a feather boa, or you know, just stuff like that. But you have to have ten different one of those in ten different scenes in your video. Good luck. Within shouting distance, you can hear a flying man's bluff, dragging Little girl, just me, girl. Just me, honey. Yeah, I'll don't lie on the ground. Maybe, can you sit? Come on, honey. Come on, Maggie, can you sit, honey? Look at honey, sit. Come on. Maggie, you suck. Good girl. I'll don't make the camera. Instead of buying his tongue, the devil's in the air.